Hello everyone, it is January 15th, 2016, day 21, part 1 of the One Year Transformation. Um, this video is a little bit later because I had switched my hours for home health care. And uh, I'm home now, so that's nice. I get to relax for a little bit. This morning has been good mentally. I was a little tired. Um... Every time I say, um, I'm putting an extra penny aside. So I've said it twice in this video and I'm going to get two pennies. So one, two penny challenge has been going good. I have a, I think a dollar saved up. Don't quote me on that. Also the dime challenge that I'm doing is just to see how much, how many dimes I can save up in a year. And I have it in a three liter, liter bottle. So, that's going good. There's like $3 worth of dimes in there. And Snoopy has like $20. The Snoopy bank that I have has about $20 worth of change. I do keep track through an app on my phone, which is very good for me. Um, there we go. Another um. Two ums. Three. All right. Maybe this will start helping me. So, one, two, three. So, that makes... Three, five cents. Okay. Penny challenge, good. Dime challenge, going good. I start back at the nursing home tomorrow. I have a short shift, 3 to 7 p.m. And I start back at the college on Sunday. I'm there for 10 a.m. So I will have to go a little earlier and try to eat something before I go. Or I'll get something on the way. And I start back full time next week for the college. So things are good, and uh, I really haven't hung out with anybody lately. Normally I would hang out with Jen, but I don't think she she wants people around. I know she works full-time as a toddler teacher at the Y here in town, so I know that she can get exhausted. And um, another penny. Another penny. Six pennies. She... I don't know. I feel like I've grown apart from her and that she never wants me around. In relationships, I think it's a two-way street and feel like it is a one-way street when it comes to me and her because she always tells me, oh yeah, I'm around, I'm around. And I do know that she's very bad about texting people, but I think she talks to certain people. Yes, she does talk to her family and I know that would be number one priority. I have no problem with that. I have a problem when I have to put in all the effort. I shouldn't have to be the one putting all the effort into a friendship when she's not going to return it. So, and, and she wanted to celebrate my birthday with her boyfriend. I don't think so. I have this firm belief that if it's your birthday and you want to have your own thing, go for it. I think you should. And I hate it. When people want to combine birthdays, like, uh-uh, I will not do that. I have decided now that I want to do my own thing. I'm going to do it. So I never joined them for James's birthday. I did wish him a happy birthday on social media. And I didn't go because I just don't feel that it's right to combine birthdays. And I don't feel the group of friends that she hangs out with, that, yes, I have known, I don't feel like they want me around to have the time and that I'm just so different that they don't like it. Like, they cannot handle me at all. So, I don't talk to anybody. I have done nothing over my winter break from Sodexo. We had four weeks off. It's been a nice four weeks off. I'm a little bored, but now I'm kind of sad because... One of the executive chefs gave me another show to watch, so now I'm, like, trying to watch shows like Mad Crazy. I'm still watching Once Upon a Time, so that makes me happy. And I feel that with friends or people that want to hang out with me, they never do. They never get in touch with me. One friend I don't get in touch with, uh, she is a co-worker at one of my jobs. And it's okay that we don't really, you know, text each other or talk to each other besides being at work. She's always too busy for me anyway, so it doesn't matter. Uh, let's see. So there's that. Things are good. I'm doing good. I'm back to three jobs. And 
right now everything's going great today a little tired i probably just need to get my vitamin d in and that's probably why i'm sleepy plus i went to well i thought it was later last night but it was only 10 30 and i was like ready for bed why i was watching once upon a time and i decided to quit for the night so I could get, you know, go to bed and get a good seven, eight hours of sleep. And I thought it was much later. No, it was 1030. It felt like 11, 1130 at night. No, 1030. Oh, well. All right. So I'm going to end this video because it's almost six minutes. So six pennies extra today for the penny challenge because of the one word I'm trying not to use. So you guys have a great afternoon. I will update later tonight. And you guys have a great day. Bye.